Prior to being an owner at Closet Factory, I was traveling extensively. I wanted to change my lifestyle. I wanted to slow it down and spend more time with my family. So I started to look at different businesses, and one of the businesses that I came across was Closet Factory. One of the things that really attracted me toward the business was the product. We started our franchise in Colorado when our children were five, seven, and nine. And we taught them how to ski, we coached their soccer, we helped run their swim teams and went to all their swim meets, and we still ran a business. So the flexibility of um, making a good living and supporting our family has been very important to both of us. Before joining Closet Factory, I owned an independent closet company, and I felt I had taken it as far as I could on my own. And I wanted all of the systems and procedures that, that Closet Factory gave me um, to allow me to take the business to the next level and become successful. Previously, we would purchase a business, build it up, and then sell it off, and then look for the next opportunity. We've been Closet Factory owners for over 10 years now, and I have no desire to sell this business. The profit margins, the ability for us to continue to garner cash flow out of the business has mitigated any, any idea I had of ever selling it. It's endless as to what I like about the Closet Factory. I love the fact it's where designers' dreams come true. You can build anything, you can make anything. It never stops evolving. It's always something new, so it never gets boring. We chose Closet Factory because after we began our research, uh, we learned how important quality was, how much control is local, and uh, the wide range of products that we can offer is pretty impressive in the industry. We also both have engineering backgrounds, so we felt like um, the focus on quality uh, was very important to us and customer service. We live in the community and we want to make sure that the people that we see day to day uh, are really happy with what we produce and are telling their friends and family about what we do as well. I was teaching preschool, a uh, stay-at-home mom, and um, when this idea was thrown at me from my husband, I was like, you've got to be out of your mind. And here we are 17 years later and it was the best decision we made.